Welcome to our ExaQuantum training video. Before installing ExaQuantum ARA, a number of prerequisites need to be undertaken and checked for a combined server install. A compatible version of ExaQuantum PIMS must be installed and running correctly. ExaQuantum should be receiving alarm and event data. A web server is installed and running correctly. The correct version of Microsoft.NET Framework is installed. IIS features and components have been configured. SQL reporting services has been enabled and is running. If running a separate data and web server, the compatible version of Microsoft.NET Framework will need to be installed on the web server. XQuantum PIMS is in a stopped state. Once the prerequisites are complete, insert the ARA DVD. If Auto Run is enabled, the launcher will appear. If not, navigate to the root folder of the DVD and run the launcher application. Click the server install link and click the next button. Tick the license terms checkbox and click next. If you have a separate ARA web server, then change localhost to the server name. Otherwise, just click next. If you are connecting to a fast tools server, enable the fast tools connector. If you wish to use a different location for the ARA files, use the browse button to change the path, then click next. Click install to begin the installation process. When the installation completes, click the finish button. Now click the web server install link. Click the next button, tick the license terms checkbox and click next. If you have configured a separate website for ARA, you can choose it now. If not, choose the default website. Leave the virtual directory unchanged and click Next. The application pool settings should remain unchanged, unless you have special requirements, in which case please contact YMX support. Otherwise, click Next. If you have a separate ARA data server, enter the name, otherwise Leave as local host and click next. If you wish to change the install location, click the browse button to select a new folder. Otherwise, click next. Click install to start the installation process. When the installation completes, click the finish button. Once the installation is complete, there are a small number of post install tasks to carry out. Firstly, Add users to the QARA view group. Check that the web page is visible and check the ARA job processing status. Open the server manager. Expand the tree to locate local groups. Now add any users to the QARA view group who need to access alarm report. Right click the group and choose property. Click Add and enter the usernames and then click OK. Click OK again to finish. Now close Server Manager. Open Internet Explorer and navigate to the URL for ARA. You'll be prompted for your user credentials. Check that the ARA web page appears with the correct logged in user. There will be no data yet because no process has taken place. At least one ARA update job has to complete before data is displayed on the ARA dashboard. You can now close Internet Explorer. The installation process is now complete and ARA can be configured. For more information, contact us or visit our website. Thank you for watching.